anytime you get any organism uh, that is not native to an area move in, um, the consequences are really immeasurable and unfortunately we do know this one has some pretty severe consequences uh, to agriculture through its, um, its uh, propensity to uh, devour honey beehives. Our entire Hornet program hinges on sort of three main bits. Finding them on the landscape first, um, so that's using our traps and, and reports from people to locate them. Tagging them with a radio transmitter so that we can follow them back to their nests, which are hidden away in dense brush in the deep forest. Uh, and then the third one is, is eradicating that nest. bulky, <laughs> bulky, but I guess that's good. Um, you do feel pretty protected since it's all sealed up pretty well. I think my biggest fear for the this year is that there will be lots of nests out in our county and we just don't know where they are. That's that's the biggest problem is, is nests going undetected. So that's why it's so important for the public to continue telling us when they think they see one, even if it turns out it's not true, and, it's, and why it's so important for us to hang crazy bottles of orange juice everywhere. The news can be a lot. There's a lot of good out there, and a lot of fearless kids and families putting kindness into action in their own communities. But the first step towards helping is understanding, and that's where we come in. Everyone wants to understand the world, which is why we're bringing the news to your family, the Now This Way. Each week, we'll talk about the important issues, the positive progress, and the unsung heroes who are changing things for the better. With the weekly YouTube series, podcast, and newsletter, we'll explore the uplifting stories that inspire us and dive deep to understand our changing world together on Now This Kids.